Hi, I'm Sophie Jordan Collins. I'm a 19 year old actress from Michigan, now living in Los Angeles. And I'm going to take you guys through a day with me. I'm doing a collab photo shoot. And then I filmed seven self tapes. It's ones which I gave myself fake bangs for. I did my first ever live event, which I booked 30 minutes before my call time and knew absolutely nothing about. I really hope this isn't like a Playboy house type sitch vlog i also booked a shoot today for monday that pays for and i even talked to you guys a little bit about how some of these shoots pay me so i started off my morning this was friday december 9th of course you know reading journaling doing the whole shebang driving to set and by that i mean not really moving oh this is cute really professional oh this lighting man am heading to set right now i'm doing a collab photo shoot so basically this is where a photographer just pays you a small amount of money and mostly you get paid just through having the nice photos so it's a big thing in like la new york all the markets but i thought it'd be fun to take you guys along i did my own hair and makeup for this usually for collab shoots you do brushed my hair natural and i did very natural makeup so i didn't feel like that would be a fun thing to see Number one. Always going through creepy little hallways. It's very cold. Outfit number two. Get ready. Are you ready? I don't think you're ready. So when Sophie gets into self-tape mode, I just kind of throw everything around. I hit a very quirky self-tape. I put a lot of effort into this. Anyway. <laughs> um, I had a photo shoot this morning, as you guys saw, and then I filmed seven self-tapes from like 12.30 to whatever time it is. I ended at like five dinner and I got a call about standing at an event dressed as a statue for six hours and getting paid $400 in Beverly Hills. And he called me and he was like, basically telling me I had to tell him yes on the phone because it's like a last minute booking, their other chick canceled. So I guess- It is editing, Sophie. I have an oil mask in my hair, don't judge me. I did want to say that this wasn't some just like random guy calling me. This was something I submitted for on LA Casting, which is a website where there's acting and modeling jobs. So it was something I had submitted myself for and he was calling me about it. It wasn't just like some random guy. I just want to clarify that. Anyway, I hope you like eggs. So usually it's only $300, but they upped it to 400 and I was like on the phone with him and I didn't really have any plans tonight other than to like clean all this, leave this mess, I guess. And from six to 12, I'm going to go stand as the statue. Now we'll see what exactly this thing is. I'm leaving in about 10 minutes. I'm gonna quickly change out of this. Um, I need a bang. The drink bang, not I need to bang. Yeah. I really hope this isn't like a Playboy house type sitch. Just me literally shirtless. We don't strive for perfection. This is what I signed up on. Hopefully that gives me a personality since I woke up at 5.30. Yeah. Can we bring ankle boots? My room is significantly better. You can kind of see. Okay, it's a little better. Anyway, let's go. There's this weird thing with LA parties that I've experienced a few times. But if you know me, I'm not a partier at all. But anyway, where you like park at one location and they shuttle you to- Apparently I park somewhere they're gonna shuttle me, but the guy who's like in charge of us told me I can ride with him to the party so he can make sure I leave right at 12. $400 to stand there in like a silver disco costume for six hours. Yeah, okay. Vlog, I also booked a shoot today for Monday. That pay Sorry if like talking about money triggers you, but honestly, I get curious about that stuff and I feel like that's something people wonder a lot is like how much do actors get paid for stuff and i'm stressed though is i booked a shoot for monday but i work monday and if it was like a pre-production day it would be super chill if i missed totally fine but we're actually shooting like a big video that a lot of planning has gone into on monday um i do audio and we're gonna need a lot, a lot of lavalier mics they're just a little like clip-on mic because we have a lot of characters and i just would feel like an a-hole just leaving my team so i've been messaging another girl trying to see if she's able that we've worked with in the past to see if she's able to do audio on 
Monday. My kind of rule because I do enjoy my day job. For example, this day I was blowing up a ton of balloons. This day we went to the Van Gogh exhibit. It's just, you never know what you're gonna get, so. A lot. So my rule with like acting jobs is either I'm super passionate, about, I'll take it of course, cause after that's my main thing. But if it's something that it's like kind of dinky, I won't do it. But if it's kind of dinky and it pays double what I make at my day job, I will do it. That's rare though. One thing about California, people are so freaking nosy. You know you're not rich and you don't know how to work the toilet, but look. What? 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 Let's talk about how their fridge is stocked with PG. I know, are we lost? Yeah, welcome to the show. Oh, yeah. You know what though? It's 12.17. We finished like a half hour early. I'm dead inside because, again, I got up at 5.30. <laughs> Still better than last weekend. If you watched that vlog where I was up 25 hours before I went to bed. And I did two shoots in one day, which technically... No, because it wasn't a shoot. Two gigs in one day. And had a day of self-taping. Um, luckily, none of the tapes were urgent, like, due tonight. I know, my lips look so crusty. Edit all those tapes tomorrow and just get my life together tomorrow. 